so you've embraced the importance of using sunscreen to help prevent both photo aging of your skin and even skin cancer. And you understand the two simple sunscreen criteria to look for to get the best protection, an SPF of at least 15 and broad spectrum UVA protection. Great, then it's off to the sunscreen aisle to buy your sunscreen. Easy, almost. Do you get a lotion, a cream, a spray, gel, towelettes, pads? Today I'll help you through the last decision in choosing the best sunscreen for you. Hello, I'm Dr. Neil Schultz, and welcome to Derm TV. The sunscreen aisle has a dizzying array of vehicles that the actual sun protective ingredients are dissolved in, including lotions, creams, sprays, gels, towelettes, and pads. And sunscreens with the same SPF when used properly offer the same level of protection regardless of the vehicle. So, what's the advantages of each? Let's start with sunscreen lotions. They're all about spreadability. It's much easier, faster, and more economical to apply a lotion all over your body than any other vehicle except a spray. And lotions can also have moisturizers, so you get both sun protection and a moisturizer from one product. Oh, by the way, no one's ever been arrested for using a body lotion on their face if you like how it feels. But since I mentioned sprays, let's deal with them now. Bottom line, I don't recommend them. Sprays are popular because of their convenience, ease of use, and their almost invisible finish. You can't see them and can barely feel them. Aha, that's just the problem. Because you can't see or feel them, you don't know whether you've missed parts of your skin, especially areas on your back and the sides of your body. Among sunscreen users, I see the worst sunburns and people who use sprays, and unbeknownst to them, miss areas. Cream sunscreens are richer, more emollient than lotions, and are very popular for your face. But because they're not as easy to spread over large areas, they're not suitable for the body. But they are a great way to get extra moisturization and sun protection for your face at the same time. Sunscreen gels are useful for your face if you have oily, acne prone or combination skin since they're very lightweight, finish invisibly so you can't feel them and won't clog pores or cause breakouts and acne prone skin on your back, face or chest. They however are not suitable for dry skin. Sunscreen towelettes and pads are similar to each other. Towelettes are used for the body and pads for the face. They're a very quick and convenient way to apply sunscreen if you like lightweight products and don't need a moisturizer, especially in acne prone areas. They finish invisible to the touch, and they're great for active people since if you sweat, they don't run down into your eyes. And last, they're perfect for toddlers who resist application of creams and lotions. Just give them the pads, make a game out of it, and then you finish up making sure all needed areas are covered. So now you know everything you need to know to buy your sunscreen. And after you buy it, please use it. Doesn't work in the bottle. Please join me again at DermTV.com. If you have a question, please send it to me by visiting dermtv.com slash question. I'm Dr. Neil Schultz, and thank you for watching today.